Naruto 632 viewer comments part two. Let's go ahead and start with Mo Prada. Sakura is not Sakura is a continuing thing. Sakura is not Naruto and Sasuke's level. Naruto did not only master Sage Mode, he also mastered the Tell Beast, and there he's given even more stronger than Sasuke, in my opinion. I mean, look at what Naruto and even Sasuke EMS achieved so far, and all Sakura did was deal one punch and getting saved by her teammates again. She's just not that strong, and I fear she's getting hyped a little too much right now. There we are. Appreciate the comments. Bro Army 1000, this fight has been ruined in my opinion. I can't see there being a grand climax in this fight because I feel Madara has basically surrendered. Already knew he would lose, but for it to be presented in such an obvious manner is sickening. That kishy dude should be ashamed. Well, I'm not feeling ashamed, but yeah, I... I I agree with you on that. It kind of was, it was a letdown. Very well said, actually. Appreciate the comment. The Thunder Pow Wow. So I think Obito and Kakashi join. The fray and Obito will be like, hell no, girl. <laughs> it fights Minato and Naruto. Then Madara, first to fight the first, the second, and the third, and the rest fight the Ten Tail. Sakura, a boss. Jiminy Christmas, talk about Buha strength. I wonder if she can do slug summoning. I think Madara isn't helping out because he knows they are no match for the beast, so there is no point intervening. Appreciate the comments. Papa76 Mac, I have to disagree with you about the Madara thing. He's already stated that he's bored in Naruto and the Shinobi Alliance, which he did. He wants to fight Hashirama, so it's cool that he's chilling, lol. But what is he trying to achieve? I mean, all this stuff, coming back from death and doing this and creating Frankenstein Abito and all this, just... I mean, I realize he's an ego, okay, he, you know, but I mean, to achieve what? I, I'm, he's just to, just to fight the Edo friend that he... I don't know. His, it, for me, it's just falling apart. But anyway. <laughs> but he is chilling. All right. Appreciate the comment. Okay. Mohammed Quayam Yeha. Totally true. And besides that, Hashirama was the first one who, being cocky to Madara, Madara was just trying to be badass, just like Hashirama did. Ha <laughs> ha. And, uh, <laughs> okay. Let's go ahead and keep moving. Okay, keep going on here. Okay, for some comments. Uh, Grand Fiction. I found it interesting that Madara wasn't concerned about if Hashi and the rest of the ninjas can defeat the Ten Tails. He said that he will wait as if he knows the ninja army will somehow subdue or defeat the Ten Tails. Yeah, he doesn't seem to care, right? I, that, that's why I'm saying we, his character, we need to have some inkling of either he's got something up his sleeve, he knows something, okay, there, there, or, you know, there has to be some, I mean, the, the, like I said, the whole idea that he'd go through all that, and then, and I don't think an Edo is going to survive in everything, that reality being completely leveled and recreated, so it just doesn't, it just doesn't hold up to me, I appreciate the comment. Michael Gethman, I think Hashirama considers Madara weaker then him, why else would Hashirama go fight Madara with a wood clone? Then Madara threw a fit and didn't want <laughs> didn't want to play with Hashirama's wood. That's hilarious. Okay, this is getting to an area that with Hashirama and I had to say at the beginning I was I had to say I actually went once at the level people started making the comments already. I had to kinda of admit that it kinda of did fall within those uh, parameters. Anyway, Michael Gethman continues. Sakura on the same level as Sasuke and Naruto. It's just, I say all the way through, this keeps coming up. She needs to show more than a diamond on her forehead and great strength. I want to see a katsu like creature. Actually, I want to see Manda and Gambuta and Katsuya. That would be great. I agree with you. Madara is trolling us to death with this I'm ready to fight. Just kidding. 
Did Sasuke use and manipulate the amateur route without going in MS? My favorite character this week with Hashirama. Hashirama was a boss wood clones. Oh yeah, he he was definitely like, and everybody definitely fell in line with Hashirama, and that's been pointed out too in the comments. All right, really do appreciate your comments. Comment Bob Nine. I don't like Madara being sidelined so much either. Though I kind of expect Kishimoto to do it. Madara has been made very OP and could easily have killed a lot of them if he fought more seriously. A turnoff for me was when he decided to spare all the Kages after several months of fighting because he had grown bored. No, no Madara, no. He's been slacking off ever since. My hope is that in the final battle, Kishi doesn't dumb him down too much in order for the heroes to beat him. I have to agree with all that. Uh, and I, I don't know if this is continuing or I'm reading the wrong order, but kind of Bob Dine. Still, he's Madar and I love him. It is truth that he has carried this manga for a while, especially during the lowest point ever with the Toby reveal. Speaking of which, I know you said you might not watch the anime anymore, but seeing Madara fight for the first time might be pretty interesting. I'm still waiting for that to happen, and whenever these month, months of fillers end, the anime should be called Filleruto. Um, yeah, I, hey, you know what? Uh, as far as the anime, um, I don't enjoy it, but I have to say that that doesn't mean anything. It, people it, enjoy it or whatever. I, I don't. Like I say, I, I, I've just kind of, at least for the moment, you know, am not interested. I've just gotten really, really bored with it, even before the fillers. I was just tired of it. But uh, there's nothing wrong with watching it. Nothing wrong at all. All right, and Colin Bob Nine, I always appreciate your comments and insight. Okay. Magnus Healy, I think the chapter was okay. It's good to see Team 7 back again. So it took three years of Sakura to use this power. This <laughs> brings up a question. Why hasn't Hinata used Juho, well, I can't even pronounce that, Gentle Step, thanks for making it simple for me, Twin Life Fist. She hasn't used this technique since to protect Naruto with pain. Kishi needs to make Madara start killing people again, so this will feel like a real war. Okay, I can't take it anymore, I have to say this. Female characters, I, as much as I know people hate, there's a lot of people, most of these people are, don't like fairy tale. They, I'm not pushing anybody to watch it. I'm simply saying anybody that has continued on with the series has gotten to see some incredible... And, not, and everybody says Urza. Urza is not the only strong female character. Fairy Tale has a ton, a ton of them. Okay? Uh, awesome, awesome female characters. And I just wish that this series... I, I, I mean, I, I just wish that, that Hero would talk to Kishi a little bit about female characters and help him in that area. I just, I wish this, and I realize the hero's got some problems, too. Several of them, so I'm not, okay, I'm not going there. Okay, back to Naruto. Right. Just, the whole female character thing is, it's just, this has been all through the series. It's a problem. Moving on. All right, appreciate your comment. All right, feeling better. All right, zero, five, four, Martin. I'm going to go with that. Sakura took three years, which is better than Tsunade who took who knows how long during her time away from the village. Well, she was always excelling, and, they, and they've always said all the way through that her control has been amazing, and that her progress, and uh, just saying that what has been continually shown is her dedication, okay, which Eno didn't really have. Remember that whole thing there? So Sakura kept doing everything she could to, to advance. Okay, and so is, and, and, and Hinata too. Also, a lot of dedication, you know, to advance. So uh, you know, a lot of props in that area. Okay, so that that's pretty good. Appreciate the comments. Uh, <laughs> I got it. I'm gonna read this. Chrono off three one seven. I couldn't agree more with Madara. Went from badass to too obsessed with the first. I wish I could refute that, but that just is the way it looks. Miss for sure. Have, okay, having Sakura say she was caught up with both Naruto and Sasuke makes me think that now that she has reached her peak, Kishi will kill her off. Wow. I hope not. I think she is awesome and that this was great for her. I hope that we get to see more of her power-ups 
and that she won't die. Now, I don't, I don't think she's going to die. I hate to say this. I mean, if, 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 if since we're going to stay in the whole deal here, or at least I guess I am, if it was Sakura or, or Hinata, Hinata is going to die before Sakura. I hate to tell you this. Because we care, uh, people in general, I would just say, just my own opinion, is that the fan base in general has more of a connection, whether they believe that she should be for, you know, or, you know, whatever, than, than Sakura. Okay. Uh, Sakura, I think, gets more um, when she's been, you know, allowed to in, in the series, more respect, okay, for her abilities in, in, in fighting and being, you know, and, and smarter in, 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 in those aspects and everything. But, uh, like I say, just, anyway, just my opinion. I, so I don't see Sakura dying. I really, I don't see this happening. But, uh, well, we have the Kishimo, this is his Megan, he does whatever the hell he wants. All right, appreciate your comment. Okay, 40 sig. Soccer is still boring to me. In fact, the manga is starting to recycle itself. Okay, which one is going to get seriously hurt or die? Another death will save this manga from complete mediocrity. Yeah, I like I say, when uh, I think I'm pretty sure I'm not alone in this. When Neji died, I think everybody's like, it starts now. And that's pretty much what they're hearing. Okay, here it is. The deaths are freaking happening. And then Neji died, and it was in the impact, and the way everybody is a character that everybody liked, and, and yeah. So I don't know. It's that's an, that's another. But you know what? We all love this series. Okay, keep watching it. There's nothing wrong with criticizing it. As a matter of fact, that's what uh, that's what good fans do. They, they, really, they they don't. You don't just sit there. Oh, everything's great. You have to criticize it, you know, and then praise the parts that are good. That's the way this works. Appreciate your comments. All right, just do a time check. All right, King Devon Forty, Madara must have something up his sleeve. If you notice, he hasn't once been bothered or, or have shown any concern to what's going on. My personal opinion, I think Madara is just uh, biding his biding his time to explode. Could be. It just doesn't make sense. Well, like I said, we need something, or at least an inkling, some something that, that he's up to something. Right now, it's just like nothing. Okay. All right. Uh, let's see. K K H Mixer X. Uh, uh, I think I'm reading this right. Okay. Madara's inaction makes sense when you put it in perspective. Number one, you have to remember what kind of person he is. He has a god complex, and anyone who has been following anime for a reasonable length of time knows that characters with a god complex tend to underestimate and disregard just about everyone around them at all times. Number two, there's no doubt about it that Madara is one OP mother and any fight <laughs> he is put into that isn't against Hashirama or anyone else of the Kage's level is just a waste of time. Remember he single-handedly massacred five Kages. Why bother putting him up against someone who can't tango with him in the slightest? That's probably Kishimoto's mindset if I were to make an educated guess. And that's, see, that's, that's another thing. That may be true, but he hasn't really, you know, sold it to the majority of us. So anyway, I really do appreciate the, com uh, the comments. Okay. Okay, Mr. Marcus, this chapter was great, but a lot was going on. Let's start with Sakura. Great that she's now coming into her own, but still hasn't matured, still sucking up to Sasuke and dismissing Naruto every time, which is unfair. The other thing that just uh, Jugo mean when he said, what are you thinking about Sasuke? Could Sasuke have a hidden agenda? to take over the village after all, or is Ochimaru taking over Sasuke's body? Something is really fishy. Well, I for one hope so. I I really want to see this. Ochimaru has been my favorite. I want, I, there's, there's so much hope I have for Ochimaru to really just pull some insane evil garbage. I just simply can't wait for it. Anyway, I really do appreciate the comments, and we're going to go ahead and end this part. And it looks like we'll have look like one more video out of this. All right, whenever you're ready, meet up in part three.